Hey, this is Jordan and Damien, and we are going to fly the MCPX. Let's start up this radio. We're using the DX7 today, and here's the MCPX. So we are going to plug in this battery, just like so. Lit bind. There we go. And we're going to fly it in normal mode. No 3D for right now because we are doing some testing on it. We just got it set up. So let's give it a rip. We are running a little bit more pitch on this since the normal settings are too slow, which we find out, right, Damien? Yeah. They were too slow for this helicopter, and the pitch wasn't enough. So yeah, you get more pop with more pitch. And it feels more locked in. You're not going to get that falling feel. But if you're not good with 3D or hold, holding it, you're not going to like these settings. No, go with the normal settings and the manual. Also, you have to be very careful. This is not like your Blade MSR. I turned it on and cut my hand really bad. Did I? Oh, yeah. This morning. Testing out how responsive the servos were. That was a nice save. Hey, have you made punch up? Oh yeah, sure. Okay, so what I like about this helicopter is very stable, even with aggressive setup, no hands. In fact, it's hit by it either. Yeah, right. Um, so stable, you can literally catch it. Put back in there. Um, I'd recommend this for like more of an advanced pilot, more of a faster pilot kind of helicopter. Something that can easily do some 3D if needed. Or no, no, normal mode, so we really can't do that in 3D. But as you see, very stable helicopter. But dangerous also. I mean, this helicopter can do some damage if you're not careful. It looks like a very sta stable toy helicopter until actually you the power of it. Um, we did some 3D outside. Very responsive 3D. Um, needed a, a couple of tweakings, but nothing much, nothing major. But overall, I mean, like, as you see, I actually like this little blue light on this canopy, as you see. Mm. And the color scheme with the, the red, white, and blue seems very nice. And overall, I think it's a very stable 
helicopter. So if you've flown the MSR, probably your next step. If you wanted to get into helicopters, the MCX would probably be the best way to go. But as you see, I mean, I'm controlling this thing pretty smoothly through, this, through my house. And these basements are not very tall either. And they're really small walls for the ceiling. It's a great indoor helicopter for you guys. If you, have, if you guys have a TRX 700 like it's going to be hovering right next to, or a TRX 450, great helicopter for you to try it. Um, how many minutes are we at right now? 5.47. Well, let's uh, put it down since it's been over three minutes and we don't want to run the battery down. And uh, thanks a lot. Thanks for watching this video. This is the Blade MCX. And hope you guys enjoy it and buy you one for yourself. Thanks.